Just lockdown happened and uh, I lost all my customers and uh, everybody with a fear of this virus cancelled and I had nothing and I thought, Ya Allah, what am I going to do? I know how I feel. I don't have anything to eat. I, I didn't make any income. I didn't do any business. How am I going to be able to eat this Ramzan if all these people here that depend on me every year for iftar to get something to eat? How are they going to survive? I survive with what I make for the year and in that way I can also help others. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Ruweira Fredericks. I found myself in a very bad situation. Four children to see to them. They were very young and I didn't know what to do. I had no job, no income, no losing everything, your home, your marriage of 24 years and starting over and with nothing. You know, it was so bad. My kids were crying for food and uh, they weren't accustomed to not having anything to eat. Because I was involved in Islamic workshops and stuff like that, I don't I do the Ramadan savories. She called me up and she said, you know what, Rueda, I will help you. You can do my savories and I'll pay you for the day. And then let's see how it goes. I'll try and send it out through social media and see what comes up. And it started from there. And I started and as I went along, I thought about, you know, my hardships, what I'm going through with my family at home and how are the people around me feeling that's in my same situation. So I collected from each customer for the mosque to do iftar. I came to see if that first Ramadan there was only kajur and water, you know, and like about 80 people and it broke me and I, I couldn't believe it. What is this? What's happening? You know, how can this happen? I've come from that, I've done that and here it's again. What is Allah trying to show me? Two of my customers, Yasmin, Amina and uh, uh, two other ladies and I told, told them what my intentions are. Can they please sponsor me to do if that for the masjid? Can they please let help me help few of my neighbors so that I can give them a plate of food to eat? And that's how uh, they got uh, Shukar Africa Muslim Agency to come through and come and help me. The biggest challenge people are facing right now is what the pandemic that is happening. A lot of people are generally unemployed and with a lockdown it's devastating. People are in total anxiety and uh, they, they don't know what to do, what's going to happen to them, whether they're going to have food. Your participation is required.